And here he is, starting things off with a front side approach, pumping the waves, starting things off with an alley-oop to mute right there. There's another big grab from Noah Flegel right into a slash. There's the alley-oop backside 360. Big alley-oop 180 and front side shove it right after that. There's an on surface 360 and a 360 shove it for Noah Flegel as he regains his balance and comes in with momentum. Going alley-oop backside 360, throwing a grab in there for good measure. There's the backside big spin and shove it to get back around to regular. He's got time for about one more trick. Going for the 540 shove and just can't make it happen. Keep your eyes peeled, ladies and gentlemen. This is his final pass. Starting things off with a double grab on the nose and then linking it into a big slash. There's the judo air, putting his hand on the board and kicking his front foot off the board. Then doing alley-oop 360 into a surface 360. Noah then going shove to mute right into a side slide. Now taking the backside surf position. There's the front side big spin back to his toes. A judo alley-oop backside 180, taking it to revert now on his toes again. There's the alley-oop. 540, revert back to one, and going for the shove 540, an unbelievable run. Yeah, so coming into the first stop of the Pro Tour, I haven't honestly been wake surfing too much. I've been super focused on wakeboarding, and I was thrown into super hard heat, and I didn't even make out of the quarterfinals, and that hasn't happened to me in a long time. So that bummed me out, but I was still in it for the wake surf, and I'd made the final. It was a heavy final, and I just threw it out on everything that I wanted to, and I ended up on top. So it was a great way to start out the first Pro Tour.